Hi, this is Shubhayan Chakravarti for Rev Sports. So the Indian team has left for Australia for the T20 World Cup, but it wasn't a complete 15-member squad that flew on the early hours of October 6. The photos and visuals of Rohit Sharma, Virat Kohli, among others, went instantly viral. Uh, but the Indian team, in reality, was a player shot. It wasn't a complete 15-member squad, but 14. Uh, by now, we all know that Jaspreet Bumrah has been ruled out of the T20 World Cup due to a back injury. That was a huge blow. Uh, and with the BCCI yet to name a replacement, the team had to fly with a player short. So, what's the current status? Mohammad Shami is hot favourite to replace Jaspreet Bumrah in the main squad for the T20 World Cup. But currently, he is at the NCA in Bengaluru undergoing extensive uh, tests to determine his level of fitness. As per medical protocol, any player who is out of uh, COVID uh, needs to undergo ma mandatory cardiovascular test to check the lung, lung capacity and how it is functioning uh, post-COVID. Uh, but an important point to note here is Shami did hit the nets uh, in his farm house in Amroha before going to uh, Bengaluru. Uh, so his fitness is completely not out of place. Uh, so that would be important as well. Upon clearing the fitness test, uh, Shami, if deemed fit, uh, by the medical staff will fly out to Australia to join the med uh, main squad. He is currently in the standby list. Even other standby players like Shreya Sayyar, Ravi Bishnoi and Deepak Chahar didn't fly uh, to Australia with the main squad. They will uh, instead play the ODI series that will start today against Australia. And, and uh, they will fly out on October uh, tw uh, 12th. And by then uh, the medical team, the team uh, management will also have a clearer view of uh, Shami's fitness levels as well. But the good thing is Umran Malik and Kuldeep Sain, they both flew uh, with the Indian team to Australia as net bowlers. For the men in blue, the first stop uh, will be uh, Perth where they will have a preparatory camp uh, while facing Western Australia in a couple of warm-up matches before shifting base to Brisbane uh, where they take on New Zealand and Australia in their final warm-up matches before the showpiece event starts. So that would be important as well. Uh, but let us know uh, who do you think should replace Jaspreet Bumrah in the India's uh, T20 World Cup squad that, because that replacement will play a crucial role. Um, we all know that Mohammad Shami brings uh, similar skill sets uh, to Jaspreet Bumrah. He can bowl uh, good in the power play. He has a terrific record in the power play in terms of wicket taking. He was phenomenal in the IPL. Uh, even, in, even in the death, uh, he picks up wicket but is a tad expensive. Uh, whereas Deepak Chair is very similar to Bhuvneshwar Kumar, bowls uh, brilliantly in the power play, gets uh, the ball to swing, uh, but uh, then his, his uh, death bowling is questionable too. So let us know which player do you think uh, should replace Bumrah in the, in the main squad and we'll continue to give you all the updates when it comes to Shami's fitness and uh, who, uh, who is coming uh, ahead in the pecking order when it comes to Jaspreet Bumrah's replacement. That's it for now. Uh, keep watching Red Sports. Thank you.